Hi everyone, I'm Gabi, the CEO of Microgenesis. We created the technology that will change fertility industry for women and couples everywhere. We have been working during the last two years with the most complex fertility cases. Now we are bringing down our innovation to OBGYNs and direct to consumers. At certain age, women start to wonder, how fertile am I? Do I need to start now? Whether they go to the OBGYN or their buy online, the standard test only measures five hormones, indicators of ovary function. But this is a really old test and fertility is very important to rely on a 30-year-old test. We pretend to replace this traditional test for a far better one, the one that diagnoses the real problem and tells us how to fix it. Women have heard that they cannot get pregnant because of their age. At microgenesis, we detangle age from inflammation. Our fundamental insight is that infertility is due to the dysbiosis of a fertility biome. When functional microorganisms are missing, immune cells get depolarized and attack the intestinal barrier, leading to autoimmunity, metabolic syndrome, and endometriosis. To evaluate a fertility biome, women send us one swab. We analyze their biome using real-time PCR to hunt for microRNA signatures. MicroRNAs are the functional markers of the dysbiosis. Combined with the information we get from a blood test, we categorize patients into 64 discrete phenotypes. During the next 90 days, women are sent nutraceuticals, probiotics, and recommendations for changing what they eat. We have 53 treatment combinations tailored to the 64 phenotypes, and it is free of prescription drugs. This is important not only because women prefer natural solutions. This is important because drugs screw up the microbiome, the very thing we need to fix. We have treated over 300 women, but it is important to understand that we didn't start with the typical cases. We ran our clinical study on women like Christina. After 11 years trying to get pregnant and eight expensive failed in vitro fertilization procedures, Christina was suffering. We diagnosed her through a swab test and we treated her with our customized nutraceutical diet. 90 days later, she was expecting her first baby, Emma. Christina was just one of the 287 patients in our clinical study across Spain and Argentina. All of them were suffering. They had all failed, not one, not two, but four in vitro fertilization procedures. And within six months, 75% got pregnant. Amazingly, 32 out of these women got pregnant spontaneously without in vitro fertilization. During the last year, we extended our study to a fertility clinic in Zaragoza, Spain. Spain is the second biggest fertility market in the world. Now, 10 out of 11 women are pregnant. We extend our clinical study with an extra package of 106 couples at Wayne State University Medical Center in Detroit. This branch of the study is being run by Dr. Gilmore, the president of the American Society of Reproductive Immunology. I've known Gil for 15 years. At Yale, he was a pioneer studying the role of microbes in reproductive immunology. Fertility affects 15% of all couples, but there is no reason for women to wait until they have failed in vitro fertilization procedures to come to microgenesis. We are confident we can help far more women who are at the start of the journey. Women like Silvina, who was our very first alpha tester in our consumer-oriented D2C service. During Indibio, we have treated 15 women, and 14 out of them are already pregnant, like Silvina. Now, we have moved to the United States. We will do alpha testing in a CLIA lab in Oakland next month. We already have our first four consumers lined up. During the next six months, we will do soft launch, both online and through OBGYNs. We will help them to treat their patients and we will refer patients to them. 
we estimate charging $400 for the test and $200 per month for the nutraceuticals and probiotics. Our probiotic blend supplier is Saco System. Our nutraceutical supplier is Equinox. In our website, we are working with Woolmetrics, which is an international expert in consumer healthcare IT. Because we are in a CLIA operating lab, we don't need any regulatory approval to launch and sell our service. But regulatory approval will make our service reimbursable by insurers, so women don't have to pay it out of pocket. We expect the clinical study at Wayne State enable our approval in 18 months. Our algorithm diagnostic engine hold 15 years spent in investigating more than 3,000 complex fertility cases. Our intellectual property strategy is to patent microRNA tests and keep nutraceuticals and probiotic tailored formulation for fertility as a trade secret. Microgenesis team has more than 15 years spent in the research, innovation, and development in fertility. Our advisors include international experts in the field of business, science, and intellectual property protection. Ask yourself, would you use the same old test that doesn't predict and doesn't help, or would you use the one that gets results? Results that even fertility clinics cannot. In our future roadmap, we have a male partner test, and our vision extends beyond the birth of a baby. We will hand on our customers to make their sure their babies have healthy biomes. We welcome you to join us in bringing healthy babies from healthy families. Thank you.